Leila Abdullayeva is the spokesperson for Azerbaijan's Ministry of Foreign Affairs and she joins me now from Baku. Great to have you on the program. Welcome to you. Is there a diplomatic uh, solution to this current crisis? Uh, indeed, Azerbaijan has been committed to the settlement of the conflict via negotiations. Uh, but what we have seen so far is that Armenia is interested not in the settlement of the conflict, but in consolidating the results of its occupation policy. Because all of uh, the years that we have been negotiating, they didn't uh, bring any result. We still say that uh, the best solution of the conflict is the solution with a peaceful negotiation. But at the same time, what we are witnessing today is an uh, act of new aggression by Armenian side. And the Azerbaijani army, of course, is taking counter-offensive measures. And Leila, what are Azerbaijan's uh, red lines and what would make uh, this fighting escalate to a war? Um, let me put it as a principal position of Azerbaijan instead of red lines, because uh, here we speak about the position of Azerbaijan expressed on the international level, starting from the uh, beginning of the 90s. Here we speak about the fact of occupation of Azerbaijan's Nagorno-Karabakh and surrounding seven districts. And here we speak about the fact of more than one million Azerbaijanis expelled from their homelands. So, of course, uh, whenever you speak about the red line, whenever you speak about the principal position, is to take off the consequences, to eliminate the consequences of the conflict. And these are uh, withdrawal of the Armenian occupying forces from the Azerbaijani occupied Nagorno-Karabakh and surrounding regions, and bringing back all the internally displaced persons to their homes and to their properties. And Leila, what kind of support um, are you getting from Turkey and has this support made you stronger? Well, um, Turkey and Azerbaijan, these are two brotherly countries and we, uh, we have a strategic level cooperation between the two states. And Turkey has always expressed its strong support to Azerbaijan and we have uh, felt uh, this support all of us and uh, including the latest escalations. Of course, Turkey and Azerbaijan are participating in the biggest uh, energy infrastructure projects which contribute uh, to the progress uh, and development in the region. At the same time, there is a good cooperation in the military sphere uh, between the states as well. And, um, and let me be clear that the uh, cooperation uh, between uh, Turkey and Azerbaijan are based on the norms and principles of international law, including, of course, respect to territorial integrity of the states, and uh, are aimed to ensure peace uh, security and prosperity in the region. Leila Abdullayev, a spokesperson for Azerbaijan's Ministry of Foreign Affairs, thank you so much for giving us the perspective of Azerbaijan.